How you doing guys? Chris at Dentless Touch. Today we have something a little unique. Uh, not only is it just a big lifted vehicle, uh, we actually have a dent that was attempted before by another PDR technician. So let me show you what it looks like and we'll go from there. So it's kind of hard to see, but man up against this black truck you look down the side of it it is a big giant Audi wave it, it is nasty so I want to let you guys know you know be careful who you choose to work on your vehicle every technician every customer co uh, company is different you know check their reviews choose a reputable company to do your repairs or it's gonna end up like this I mean I'm sorry to say it but this does not look good so let's try to get this repaired and bring this uh, all aluminum F-150 back to its glory. Stay tuned. All right guys, so my plan of attack for this repair is to take the, take the door panel off. Uh, it does have laminate glass and I really don't want to leverage off of that. So I'm gonna take the door panel off, spend the extra time. Uh, we've already charged the customer to remove it, so let's get started. So the first thing I want to do is start with a clean slate. So it's going to be a lot of blending, uh, just trying to get the, the, the dent down, as, uh, the panel as flat as I possibly can to see where the lows and highs are. There's a lot of lines. Whoever uh, tried to fix it did not um, actually get on dead center onto the dent. So I do see the low uh, in that. There's a little pit. So I'm going to kind of clean up all the lines from one direction and see kind of where we're working. it's completely done right now but let me see if I can do a pan shot so you can see how it looks so that texture that you see will stand out like crazy on a black car so we got to try to smooth that out and make it look exactly like orange peel so that's the goal so quick thing I want to go over the tools that I'm using, I'm using the Stanliner Raised Snake, I believe. Uh, so here you go right there. It's the, it's like about 45, 44 inch, and then the edgy tool, the edgy tool hanger to get some leverage. All right, so since everything is flat now, I'm gonna use a little bit of glue because I just can't see the, uh, the dent um, with, the, with the door being propped open. So this time around, I'm going to glue the little lows that I see because the dent is completely flat right now. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna glue pull a little bit of the lows 
and then we should be good to go. Um, probably buff it because I, I did a lot of blending on this uh, door panel. So I'm gonna give it a nice buff, coat of wax, and uh, pull it outside and see what we have. Take the vehicle out, take a look at it under natural light, and then uh, bring it back in and put the door panel and everything back together. So that's what I just did, it looks great. Let me go ahead and put this door panel back, around, back on and uh, get this customer out. So guys, hopefully this is a lesson learned. Please do not attempt to do your own PDR repair, especially if it's something that large. That was a four inch dent that we had to sit there and correct. Uh, it probably cost me, it took me an extra hour to get that done, and obviously the customer had to pay for that additional uh, work. But hey, if you like the video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you on the next video. Peace.